Tell you what, let's have a bit of fun with something called the spray can or the paint can. It's located right down here if you don't see it. Come to this button right here. Go ahead and click it and make sure you have painter selected. Let's go ahead and turn that back on. What does it do? Well, it actually does a lot of things. Let me do a setup here. I've got some giraffe photos here and here. And I've got two swans in between them, and then two more giraffe photographs. What I want to do is I want to tag those photos with the word giraffe. Now, yes, before you even say it, I could use the control key to select them and then add it up here. I'm not saying this is the most efficient way with what I'm showing you, but once you get rolling with the paint can, it actually can do a pretty cool job. Let's go ahead and select it. Over here, it says keywords. But we can do a lot of things with this paint can. Let's go ahead and select it, keyword, and then put the keyword right in here. G-I-R-A-F-F-E, -F -F -E, I believe is how you spell giraffe. And let's go ahead then use it. Come over here and just click. Click. Now you can click and drag too if you want to. I've now assigned giraffe to those four. Let's say I accidentally put one on the swans. And you go, oh man, I gotta take that off now. Well, here's the easiest way to do it with a shortcut. Hold down the Alt key, Option key on a Mac, same key, different name, and it turns into what looks like a little eraser, and click again, and it will remove it. The paint can allows you to apply keywords and a lot of other things in a very quick and efficient way. On to the next.